What's going on? It's Mario from One Fat Frog in Orlando. We're checking in again, saying thank you for being a part of the family, for following us on social media. Today we're inside one of our 20-foot builds. Guys, we haven't done one of these in a while. This is a 20-foot build, 20-foot monster. It's going to be two fryers. We've got a 24-inch flat griddle, 24-inch char, four burner range, and we've got the big Mac Daddy, the American Range convection oven. sandwich prep table which is set up right here. Just imagine the possibilities. Lettuce, tomatoes, pickles, onions, sesame seed buns could be on top if you wanted them. <laughs> this is uh, our 48 inch under counter cooler. Over there on the other side we've got our, four, our 27 inch under counter fryer. Check this one out. Under, under counter freezer. This is set up so that you can go straight from the freezer into the fryer. Okay, so if you're, if you're cooking in bags, you can open, take them out, split them up, prep on here, Get it out here, toss it into the fires, and you're ready to go. This one has a double door cooler, which is set up right at the entrance. And on the back end, we have our three compartment sink and hand wash sink, with, along with all of our electrical breakers, which are on the back. This is built like a house, guys. Um, if you want, one of the biggest differences between um, you know some builds out there and the way the way we make it. If you look around, you won't see any cables. You won't see any wiring in the walls. This thing is set up to be like a house. I just want you to see there is nothing poking out where, where your outlets are. There's nothing over here where grease can accumulate behind the breaker pan. Okay? There's a big difference between the way the One Fat Frog, one fat frog makes our food trailers. It's quality. Look how thick these walls are. These walls are massive, guys. Behind it, they're all framed out, they're studded out. We have insulation in the walls, and underneath, you've got outlet, 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 outlet. The roof and everything else are framed out. They're welded so that they can support the weight of the hood and the weight of the ACs. You know, and it's just, it's just speaking to the quality of the builds at One Fat Frog. And as always, we encourage you guys to stop in. Check them out for yourself. Sit down with us and let's talk about your build, your concept, your dream. I want to hear about it. I want to hear about your grandma's recipe. I want to understand, you know, why you want to be in the food truck industry. What, and, I, and I'm going to do my best to give you as much information as I can. Once we start doing working together, I'll give you all my contacts and everybody else who we, who we work with and, and people that can help you launch your, your dream. So we want to encourage you guys as always to stop in, visit us, sit down with me. My name is Mario. I'm more than happy to work with you in English and Spanish, and I'll be more than happy to, to draw it out, you know, put your dreams on paper, and then hopefully we'll get started on it with, with the project, okay? So stop in, visit us. We're located in Orlando, Florida. This is One Fat Frog Restaurant Equipment here in Orlando, and we'll be waiting for you guys. We'll see you soon. Good luck. Take care, guys. Tony and I'm here today to talk about the difference between an ice cream cabinet and a gelato cabinet. Their ice cream literally has tons of cream in it, tons of good butter fat from cream that makes it uh, thicker and, and delicious. But gelato actually has more milk than ice cream, 
and is churned at a slower rate. What that means is that gelato is going to be less fat than ice cream, but it has a denser consistency because of the way that it's made. So to my left here and to your right, you're going to see a series of ice cream dipping cabinets. Now to the naked eye, these are all going to look pretty much the same. They hold five gallon ice cream tub down below. Um, as we progress here, you notice these all still look the same. But then I'm going to come up to this front cabinet and you're going to see a big major difference. Whereas the ice cream cabinets that we just walked by hold the five gallon buckets of ice cream, this cabinet right here is set up for gelato. But what's happening here is gelato is put into these pans and vended out that way. So all these, although all these look the same, these cabinets, this particular machine up front is a gelato cabinet and meant to hold gelato at a higher temperature than the ice cream. So both are very delicious summer treats. We offer, as you can see, all kinds of ice cream and gelato solutions here at the Frog. Feel free to come in and give us a visit. I can explain all that again to you in person. My name is Tony, I'm here to help. Give us a call at 407-480-3409. We'll take care of all your summer ice cream and gelato needs.